Hello and welcome to Neighborbrett. Today I'm going to reassemble the Feinwerkbau 65. And yes, the Feinwerkbau 65 is nothing for beginners. Puzzles are for beginners. Let's have a closer look. Just in time, I got mail from Germany. Here the rectangular iron ceiling, the ceiling ring. Buffer. Damper. And that this particular gun, the kickback interlock, is damaged and therefore here a new one, the kickback interlock. And of course, grease from Feinberg Pro. Parts are clean, but before assembling the parts, I take a look on the exploded view. First, I will assemble the trigger unit. ideal is when you take pictures before you disassemble the parts. They will help to do it right. Now I'm going to prepare the parts in the correct order. I don't like the grease on my fingers. Therefore, I use rubber gloves. Here are the complete trigger unit, but one part is missing. The kickback interlock, here the damaged part, the damaged part with the broken edge and the new one. The kickback interlock is below the trigger weight control. This is adjustable and your additional can switch it from about 500 grams to 
1360 gra grams I tilt it over to get a better view. Of course, that doesn't keep together as assembled, but it shows us what to do. The mailman! I need a break! My new watch! And now, business as usual. For this part, we need this the buffer. The ceiling ring and the damper. I grease it properly and now I need a new one. Oops! <laughs> Thank God, it's made from rubber. The damper doesn't fit here. Sorry. The ceiling ring is the right part and it fits here and seals the loading port on this place. We remember the old one, hard, stiff and rotten. Hear the difference? I take one of my famous Q-tips and grease it well. I push it in the right position. A piece of cake. Same procedure with the damper. Push and hold its place. Oh, there's dirt. Let's clean it. <laughs> clean it inside the cylinder. Therefore I use acetone Yes, I got it. Cleaning.
Here you see, clean it twice to get rid of all the dirt. Now the buffer. Here the old one and fragments. The buffer prevents the piston from hitting the cylinder metal to metal. The buffer needs a little force to fit in. One method is with a rubber mallet. My method, I use my weight. The damper is on its place and we will go to the ceiling. It's a rectangular metallic ring. The old one seems to be okay, but I replace it now. If you squeeze the ceiling together, it's not a problem, but if you squeeze it apart, it will break. Carefully place the ring on its place till it snaps in. Stay free. 
I use plenty of grease to lubricate the cylinder walls properly. That has the disadvantage that for the first hundred shoots, grease will come into the barrel. But it is necessary to cover the cylinder and piston carefully with grease. To put both parts together, squeeze the ring and fit it together. Now it's tight and seems to work. That's it.